All right, Kamalka, thank you. Now, that weather has been so nice lately, it's offered a number of chances to view what the legendary broadcaster Jim Leahy calls our magnificent Hawaiian Islands. A UH geologist says you might be able to see something few think is even possible. It's something even one of the planet's greatest navigators has yet to see. Nainola Thompson has seen the world navigating Hokulea using the heavens to guide the way. Safe to say he knows good conditions for seeing islands. The mornings are the best because, because the mountains are cold. So cold, dry air pushes the clouds down. And the afternoons are the worst because you have, you have the land heats quicker than the ocean and you have convection, as you know, and, and so it, it, it hides the islands. And then, and then the wind will hide the islands too. One thing Thompson has yet to see is Hawaii Island from his home of Oahu. I've never seen the big island from, from Oahu. I think it's too far over the curve of the earth, unless you're elevated up on the ridges, if you're hiking up on the ridges. University of Hawaii geologist Scott Rowland says it is technically possible, but it requires perfect conditions and being perched atop a southern Oahu peak like Coco Crater. On a clear day from Honolulu's east side, like Sunday, you can see nearly all of Maui County, Molokai, Haleakala, and Lanai. It's a really clear day today. It's really amazing. You can see the islands really well out there. But even the state's infographic on the Makapu'u Lighthouse Trail mistakenly lists East Molokai as the West Maui Mountains. It's interesting, you know, you don't know that if, you know, you're just walking along, you wouldn't know any different. You just, it's on a sign, so it's got to be right kind of thing. I probably should know that. I actually did a helicopter over like the sea cliffs of Malakai, and uh, thank you for that, because I need to do, I learn something new every day. Despite ongoing disagreements over what you can and can't see, both Roland and Thompson say you can see Kauai from Oahu and vice versa. If you're unsure, apps like Peak Finder can help show you what you're looking at. Thompson recommends folks to take the time out to look. For me, it's always being in nature and that kind of level and that kind of wild and seeing the world differently than we do from a freeway or, or, or from the shopping mall to be up in nature, it's, 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 uh, it's extraordinarily inspiring for me. So I, I, I lot of aloha for those who will, will, will take the effort to see the world in such a beautiful way.